Hello you guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Callie. We are currently remodeling our kitchen and our mobile home and rearranging some rooms to make better sense and we've got big plans for adding some spaces that I'm excited to share with y'all in future videos. But for now we're focusing on our kitchen and yeah, we're just casually starting off with our whole front door missing and you know, a piece of the wall cut out, so you can't get much more redneck than that. <laughs> um, we shoved all the furniture over onto one side so that we could fit the island through there. And it looks like my daughter already used those as a baby crib. So some of the cabinets are in there. We're missing the Lazy Susan and the uh, island. And those are the pieces that are about to be carried in and I actually don't think I got them carrying in any of the cabinets it was just uh, one of those things I had to have my hands on hoping open doors and grab things that were flying and get stuff out of the way that we didn't think we were gonna have to so um, this is us trying to well Tyler trying to figure out how to get the store back in there and they were a pain in the rear. We finally ended up getting it, but it definitely took us like, he did it for 30 minutes and then I did it for 30 minutes and we finally got it. Hey y'all, so I'm gonna show you what um, renovating actually looks like in the kitchen and just let you see how real this process is. There's a bug in here. I mean, it probably is our doors are open um this is our makeshift countertop and i did clean it before i actually like sat food on it down here is more of a workspace um there'll be an electrical outlet in there another piece of stuff that we're using as countertop we've got to get these drawers in here and so yeah, this is what our kitchen's looking like so far. And also, I don't know if I mentioned, but um, this was like these cabinets saved us a ton of money because they come out of a remodel job that Tyler was on. And so basically everything that he tore out, the people were like, you know, get rid of it. We don't need it. Maybe I explained that already. So anyway, we basically have zero dollars in the cabinet, which is amazing. And we're going to do the actual cabinets. Stop touching the camera, buddy. You can get in here with me, but you can't mess with it. Anyway, the cabinets were for like a 12-foot ceiling, and obviously we have a trailer, so it's not that tall of a ceiling. We're just going to do open shelving. I like open shelving. I think it's really cool. And it'll force me to keep things organized, so that's always a plus.
So this space that he is framing up is actually going to be our pantry. And that door right there is going to be framed off. So we are leaving that door, like, externally, the door is still going to be there for a little bit. Um, but there will be basically like a wall in front of the door. You won't be able to tell there's a door there from the inside. And we will have some shelves in there. The pantry will have a door on it. That's one of the things I'm the most excited about is actually having a good size pantry that I can organize and have food in one spot instead of like a little bitty cabinet that I used to have and having to store stuff like back in a closet in our room. But yeah, and while I'm here and you're watching him work, I thought I would just give a little bit of details about what he actually does. So, it, Tyler actually is a subcontractor, so he does this kind of work in, well, all kind of houses. You know, they work on regular houses, they work on like million dollar houses, he can do the whole nine yards. And before that, he did login, so he can do that kind of stuff, um, work on equipment, all that. I don't know that there's anything that he can't actually do. So, where are you going into it? No, tell me about it. Where's the shelf at that you drew? Use your words. <laughs> The door that he's carrying is actually from a job also. And it's kind of funny because it's off of a sauna. And it's very little, but it, it fits that pantry space. And you'll see here in just a second, it's a little bit like shorter than the door way area is. But at the same time, it's an odd shaped area anyway. So we're either going to have to build a door or we'll frame up around that one. Who knows? We'll see. You don't ever know what's going to happen. It's like shark teeth. No. takes talent. Don't you love being filmed? Mm -hmm. We got a big old bunch of project to keep on filming. I'm gonna have to get used to it. Can somebody say chaos? Look at my room. Look at my face.
Massing cane. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> dun 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 dun. I'm excited to see you. I like it. So you. I want all of that back in the box. This might be the most deer ever hung in a single wide trailer living room. Hey, Daddy, we're gonna have five deer. Six. Look, we have five on, five on that wall and then one right here. The crazy thing is, he has more. Not here. So he actually saved cabinets for our laundry room also, like a base and some cabinets to hang above it. And so we're tearing out this wall to make the laundry room actually be like the whole length of the, or the width of the trailer. Instead of just being a little bitty square room. And so it's going to be an odd layout for a little bit like we will we're moving the doorway from our bedroom to the very beginning of the hallway and we'll basically have to walk through the laundry room like straight into our bedroom for a little bit but it will all make sense later whenever we get everything done that we want to get done it's just there's going to be some awkward stages throughout the process but that is fine We'll work around them, and as long as we have water to run to things that we need to run, I do not care. <laughs> I don't see how people function remodeling their whole entire house.
This thing feels huge. Yeah, I know. Oh, I got a good amount of room up under there. Currently running the plumbing for the sink. And the dishwasher, I guess. Excuse the look, but I got a sink. I got a sink. No more washing dishes in the bathroom. Did you run? No. Joby, scoot over, babe. I'm gonna have a dishwasher. Like we had it pieced in there by the other one. This is the final test. Does she cut on? You have to press the on button. <laughs> I know, we all know. <laughs>